So I began thinking maybe they don't know everything. The last time I went in to see the endocrinologist, once I'd gotten down to zero, the doctor would not see me. He was pissed off. I don't know why he was pissed off. I, I said, gee, what, what, what did I do? The physician assistant, she came in and apologized. She said, Dwayne, the doctor's very upset with you. I said, oh, really? She goes, yeah. Um, he wanted me to tell you that you're in denial of your disease <laughs> and that, that you're collecting the data cor incorrectly or your daughter is transcribing the data incorrectly, you're doing something wrong. Um, and uh, even if the readings are true, within three months, the high glucose readings will return because there is no cure for type 2 diabetes. I heard that from the moment I came out of the coma <laughs> every day. I'm going, why are they beating this into my head? I, I, give, I, I agree. Okay, 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 there's no cure. Um, and then the, the thing that, that kind of got me to thinking that maybe they don't know what they're talking about was just before I left the hospital, um, I had four doctors, I think. Cardiologists, um, a podiatrist, um, endocrinologist, and another ologist. <laughs> Don't know, but he was collecting paychecks. Oh man, I was writing checks. Oh, neurosurgeon! And the neurosurgeon came in, yeah, Mr. McCauley, uh, we hear that you're going to be leaving and da-da-da. Well, uh, we, we, we just want to let you know that uh, you can save $250 if we go ahead and remove your legs today. <laughs> I said, and, and again, uh, you know, uh, I'm still kind of groggy and I'm going, you want to move my legs where? He goes, no, no, we're not going to move. We're going to remove. And I'm, I'm trying to listen. Remove? I don't understand. Remove them from where? He goes, well, we're going to remove them from, from you. I said, you mean amputate? Oh, well, we don't like to use that word, Mr. McCauley, because we care for our patients, <laughs> and we would prefer to use the term remove your leg. And I'm going, you're going to cut off my legs? He goes, well, y yes. Uh, but you will save $250, you, $250 because you have excellent insurance. I'm thinking, oh, so I'll save $250. He goes, oh, yeah. I, so, so if I leave and I come back uh, two months later, because the damage that had been done to my legs and the skin had turned black and, and so forth and so on, that I would have to pay this extra $250. And, I, and I'm, I'm sitting there thinking, so is it $250 I say for each leg, or is it? <laughs> and uh, I think when I told Cynthia, she goes, Dad, it doesn't matter whether it's $250 for one or both, you don't want them cutting off your leg. I said, yeah, I guess so. You know, but I was just kind of thinking about the money. I go, oh, I would say some money. <laughs> but um, uh, due to the other events, I thought maybe I should wait. And so a couple of months went by, and, and based on my blood work and how I was progressing, the, the uh, neurosurgeon they called me at home and said, Mr. McCauley, we got some great news. I said, what's that? We, don't, we won't have to remove your legs. We're only going to have to just take your toes. I said, OK, I'm sorry. I thought you said you had good news. He goes, yeah. He goes, instead of removing your legs, we're only going to remove the toes. And we're not going to take all the toes. We're just going to take the black ones on the end. I said, okay. You know, I said, okay, all my toes are black. <laughs> so you got to kind of give me a hint. Which black ones are you talking about? <laughs> oh, 
Mr. McCullough, you got to take this a little bit more seriously. Uh, gangrene can set in and uh, toxicity of the blood. And I said, like, yeah. Uh, didn't you give me that speech two months ago when you were going to cut off my legs? He goes, yeah. I said, so what do you think happened during these past two months? How do you think I got a... He goes, Dwayne, we don't know what happened, but it was, it's an anomaly. That word kept coming up. It's an anomaly. I said, an anomaly? Well, why don't we kind of go with the anomaly for a while? And so a couple of months later, no more uh, amputation. No more need to remove the legs. 